This video will show you how to retrieve extended diagnostic codes from your saw. Status codes show typical status conditions for your saw. However, your saw may experience an error state which prevents you from starting the saw or causes the saw to shut down automatically. If so, you can pull an extended error code or codes so that saw stop service can determine the problem and help you with a solution. An error code is present when anything other than a solid green LED displays after the saw initializes. Normal behavior when you switch on power is that a solid green LED is accompanied by a flashing red LED while the system initializes. The solid green LED alone means the saw is ready and there are no system errors. However, in this example, after the power is switched on and the saw initializes, the flashing red LED indicates that there is an error present. If you are not able to determine the error code from the status code's label on the saw or from the information in the owner's manual, use the following procedure. Switch on power. After initialization, the flashing red LED indicates an error is present. Turn the bypass switch 90 degrees clockwise and hold the key in this position until both LEDs turn on. Release the key at any time after both LEDs turn on. The LEDs will turn off for a second and then begin to flash to indicate the error code sequence. The red LED will blink a number of times, indicating the module ID of the error. In this case, 2. The green LED will then blink a number of times, indicating the error ID. In this case, 8. The pattern will then repeat. Here is the cycle again, slowed down. Again, this code represents module ID 2 and error code 8. This particular code means the cartridge key was not in a locked position. Once you have the error code, contact saw stop service. The service team can tell you what the error code means and how to resolve the associated issue. It is best to call while you're at the saw so service can actively troubleshoot with you. To check if there are further errors, Turn the key to the right again. If the same pattern continues, that is the only error that is present. If there is another error code, the new pattern will start flashing. In this example, there is another error code, module 11, error code 3. This indicates a spacing error between the blade and the paw. If your saw shuts down due to an error, Leave the start-stop paddle in the on position while you pull extended diagnostics. The paddle must be in the proper on position to show the proper diagnostic code. You have learned how to pull extended error codes on your compact table saw. If you have further questions, contact Saw Stop Service.